In this video, I'm going to discuss how you can use a compass in geography. In this series, I'll be showing you how to apply basic skills when studying geography. Please subscribe to the channel for more Geography Basics coming soon. In this video, I'm going to discuss using a basic compass and basic compass bearings. This is a compass rose. The most basic compass rose is broken down into north, east, south and west. There are a number of sayings to help you remember the order, such as naughty elephant squirt water or never eat shredded wheat. Most of my students write their own phrase, so you might want to have a go yourself. This is a more advanced compass rose with eight points. It also includes northeast, southeast, southwest, and northwest, and gives us a more accurate direction. So, why do we need to use a compass in geography? Well, as a geographer, it's important to use a compass when referring to locations on a map. We want to use the points of the compass north, east, south and west when describing a location or direction of travel. For instance, if we look at this map of the UK, if we're going to describe the location of London, we would say London is in the southeast of the UK. Or if describing Wales, we would say Wales is to the west of England. Another use is describing direction of travel. This is what is known as compass bearings. If you were travelling from London to Birmingham, your compass bearing would be in a northwesterly direction. If you were travelling from Birmingham to Cardiff, you'd be travelling in a southwesterly direction. Here are three more examples for you to try. Pause the screen, think about your answer, and then check the answers in the description below. That is a quick summary of how to use a compass in geography. This skill can be applied to various different situations throughout your geographical studies and will be important to anyone progressing onto GCSE geography in the future. Thanks for watching. It'd be great if you could give this video a like and subscribe for more geography basics coming soon.